Hello everyone and welcome to the Final Shot Saloon. I'm your host Clint, the 4 of 45 on Twitter. If you would be so kind to go like the Final Shot Saloon Facebook page, that'd be much appreciated. It gives you updates on more Western goodness and this podcast. Um, our friend over at GunfighterGulch.com has loaded and pulled back the trigger, pulled back the hammer, pulled the trigger, on another internet shoot. For those of you who are new to this, Greg, what he does is uh, puts out an event. It's usually uh, index. It's only index. And the lowest score wins. Usually it's about three sets of eight-foot blanks. Last December, we shot... If you were shooting on a wax target, I believe it was five feet shotgun primers at one to two feet um really a fun thing to do you basically download this spreadsheet record your times send in your uh times to gunfighter gulch and they by a certain date they post it and you just see where you fall in line and these people are from all over the globe and that's what's really cool about it and he makes it so that anybody can shoot it. There's not a, you have to have this target. You have to shoot it this style. It's open. It's twist, fan, thumb. It, he does a fantastic job at making sure everyone can shoot. Really, it's just uh, to keep the rust off during the non-shooting season. You know, uh, the non-contest season. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to read what he put on Gunfighter Gulch Facebook page. Please go like it and also go visit GunfighterGulch.com. So, howdy shooters. Real life got in the way again in January, so let's get back on track with something fun. How about a winter net shoot? I love it. You have between now and March 8th to shoot three sets of standing wax at 8 feet or standing blanks at 8 feet. For people like Bob, Bear Claw Bob um, of the Classical Fast Draw Association at your home ranges. The target is your choice. The international excuse me, the international shooters can shoot the targets and style of their associations. The purpose is better the average time you shoot in shot in the last internet showdown. If you didn't shoot with us, in the last internet shoot, you will get your average and then you can approve for the next time. Of course, taking out Doc out of first place this time is just icing on the cake. Remember that this is a f this is for fun and personal improvement as we get ready for the 2015 fast draw shooting season. You can download the spreadsheet Johnny designed from the internet shoot entry on gunfightergulch.com. If you, ha if you don't have it, contact him and he will email it to you. This is also dedicated to the gunfighter Herberto Gancho Bert uh, of the OFDA International. He went to Argentina to deal with the process of legally obtaining citizenship after working and raising his family in the U.S. and some administrative issues is preventing him from returning home. Let's send some positive gunfighter energy into the universe to help support his efforts. Feel free to post any questions on this thread so we can share the information with others. Um, good luck to uh, Herberto. For the shoot, this is February 12th. You almost have a, a month to practice to shoot it. Um what I would suggest to anybody new to it is think about March 7th as your cutoff date. That way, if anything goes wrong, you still have March 8th to 
contact Greg. Um, and remember, you can twist it, thumb it, fan it. Um, you know, you have many choices here. Standing blanks at eight feet or standing wax at eight feet on whatever target you're accustomed to. So have fun, enjoy it, and I want to be reading your name in the top five of the Gunfighter Gulch Internet Shoot on the next podcast, probably March 10th. So thank you guys. This was a quick update for the Gunfighter Gulch Internet Shoot, and we will talk to you soon. It's closing time, people.